Alright guys, welcome back to another video. Um, pick something else up. As you know, that other 1911 I did is gone. My buddy, I got it for me, and my buddy's son was graduating police academy the next day, and he's going to be a sheriff in our county. And so he wanted it for him for a gift, and so I just sold it to him. So, I ordered another one, and it's on its way, but yesterday I found this at the local gun store, Ace Hardware, and let's see what it is. So, I couldn't pass this up. I'd already ordered the other one, and I was like, I have to have this. So, it is a... Rock Island M1911A1 full size and sorry about that lighting I'm at the shop so this one is already how I was gonna do the other one skeletonized it's got the different hammer beaver tail G10 style grips serrations front and back it's a uh, I really like this one. I mean, this one's, it's ready to go how I wanted to do it. Um, it's got the dual ambi, so it's empty. This was $4.39, and I was like, I'm going home, getting money, and I'm coming back. So I went and bought this one. It's got the better sights on it than just the regular a1 the old style 1911 so i'm i'm pretty excited about this um i think i'll just go ahead and keep these grips i i want to find some aluminum ones to do some engraving on but i don't know i think this thing i think this thing looks pretty good um so that other one was Taylor's Arms Company, and it is identical to this. Rock Island and them are made by Arms Corps, same company. So the other one I showed, this is just an upgraded version, basically. Um, I was online looking, and the ones with the front serrations, everything has the tactical frame with it. This one doesn't. I don't care about the tactical frames. I'm not putting anything on this. And so I was trying to look them up last night because I was like, well, 439 for that. That's a pretty good deal. And I couldn't find anything that looked like this for sale. I think I saw one that was a 22. And this is a 45. So it's got the checkered on the back. I'm going to... With my laser machine, I have a file to checker, and I'm going to do it on this. But anyway, yep, that's a good find right there. I did not even get to shoot the other one. Never had a 1911. Finally get one. My buddy wants it. The laser engraving turned out rad. And so I'll be pretty excited. This one only came with one magazine, though, and that cheap, that cheap Taylor... Taylor's and Company came with two. So I'm going to engrave this. I don't think I'm going to do scrolls. I think I'm going to do something else. I'm not sure. What do you think in the comments should I do? I was thinking like some skulls or I don't know. I don't think I'm going to do. I think I'm going to do something different instead of the scrolls on this one. So I will do another video because I'm busy so I won't be able to get out for a few days. Well, who knows. I may go up today and try this out because I kind of missed the other one. And I think it looks good. So I can't believe I sold it. I'm glad I did though because otherwise I want to have this one at all. So there we go. I like to say so a lot because I have no idea. These videos are totally random. I don't like editing, and I just kind of go for it. We'll see you guys later. I will do a review on this. Go take out those SG targets from 
local guy that builds them, and we will see you on the next video.